Hey boss. I got them. Don't worry, they're the right person. I checked the ID. All matched out. Just give me the word and I'll send them back where they came from. Huh? Ugh. Seems our little darling has awoken. Call you back. I'm gonna go take care of them. All right. Well, good morning, cutie. Drugs wore off faster than I thought. How'd you sleep? Me? Don't worry about who I am. Oh, so you were eavesdropping on my little conversation with my boss? Mm. <laughs> what do you think I meant? What? Kill you? No. Hold on, let me explain this. The reason I kidnapped you is because your shithead of a dad decided not to pay up. So, we're holding you here till daddy pays up. Mm -hmm. No harm will come to you unless you try to escape. No, I'm much more used to killing people than keeping them alive, but uh, the school I went to trained me for this situation anyway, so. Huh? What's that look for? I look too pretty to be an assassin. Ah, uh, honey, that's what my looks are made for. So I can lure men in. And then kill them. Mm, men are women. I don't really care. <laughs> I don't really have a name. Like Widow. No. Because I can kill anyone. Not just dumb guys. <laughs> oh, you are so cute. You know that? All right, darling, I think you just need to hang out, wait for your dear old daddy to pay, and you'll be out on your way. Understand? Do you understand me, darling? Good. My employer. Well, they did some research on your father. And they found out that you were his favorite. Not only that, but you're the last remaining of his children. So, that must have some sentimental value. The way he spoils you rotten and treats you like a princess. Mm-hmm. 
He cherishes you too much to lose you. So to think it was so easy to slip that drug in your drink and steal you away. Oh, it's too easy. It was mere child's play for me. You would have think he at least had some security around you. But no. Not a single guard or camera in sight. Mm, I'm changing your mind so soon, love. I swear I can get crazier. Hell, I've seen so much bloodshed over the years. Ah, uh, so many people telling me what to do. You know, after all my years, I've seen practically almost every way to kill a person. Anywhere from drowning, to all torture methods, making them go insane and crazy. Before, they begged me to kill them. Don't let that be you. Well, I mean, I'm not going to kill you. I'm just going to make you go crazy. <laughs> Yandere. No. I'm not one of those people obsessing over you. I'm just obsessing over the ways I could kill you so easily. Mm -hmm. You mean nothing to me. I'm your pawn in this transaction. Hell, and you pay good too. Aw, why do you look so scared? Don't worry, I'm not gonna hurt you tonight. So, get all comfy in that little chair of yours. Because if your daddy doesn't pay in the next 72 hours, well... I have no more use for you, and you've seen my face, so I can't exactly let you go. My boss won't let you go either, so. <sighs> you know, when I got into this business, I abandoned my identity. Ah, oh, it's been so long since I've said my name. Mm hmm <laughs> No, I'm not gonna tell you. Why should I? You're probably gonna live anyway, so... <laughs> mm -hmm. No. I have two methods of getting you to go back to sleep. Which would you prefer? Good old chloroform? Don't worry, it won't kill you. I have the right amount of dosage. Don't worry. I have just the right amount to put you to sleep but not kill you. I mean, sure, it'll take a few minutes for the effects to work, but uh, you'll drift off rather easily. Or I have a few 
bottles of melatonin. And will knock you out for a few hours. Nice, peaceful sleep. So, which would you prefer? <laughs>